。在两岸的紧张关系之下，台湾政府表示，兵戎相见绝非台海两岸的选项。台湾外交部长吴钊燮说：“如果中国国家主席习近平和代表台湾参加亚太经合组织首脑会议的台积电创始人张忠谋在会议期间有自然互动的机会，台湾不会拒绝。呃、uh, ，The Chinese side does not seem to be interested in speaking with Taiwan, uh, or open for dialogues. Uh, we have been calling for China, uh, for dialogues.” To resolve the differences between the two sides and also to safeguard peace and stability in this region, but the Chinese have been setting very high bars for any kind of official contact between the two sides. They ask Taiwan to accept one country, two system model, and that is something that the Taiwan side cannot accept at all. If you have public opinion surveys on this question here in Taiwan. You will find that absolute majority of the Taiwanese people will reject that. Zhang Zhongmou, in 2018, has previously held a meeting with the then President Pence at the APEC conference. Wu Jiaxie, when he accepted the invitation to speak with the American press, did not exclude Zhang Zhongmou and the then President Pence from holding a meeting with the American president. We do not rule out any kind of opportunity. Uh, for the president's representative, Mark Chang, to meet with the U.S. representative, which is going to be the vice president of the United States or other leaders. Uh, and we are trying to make appointments with some of the leaders uh, who are coming to APEC uh, this time around. And we hope that we have an opportunity for Mark Chang to meet with vice president. And this is a long established presence uh, in the APEC uh, official uh, meetings or Uh, leaders' meetings, and I certainly hope that uh, the Chinese won't take that as an exception, uh, because this is uh, already a long-established tradition of the uh, APEC leaders' meetings.